Hey Smiles! Welcome back to my channel. It's me again, Miles, with my cup of tea. And I'm back with another video, which is about this mini vanity. I'm so excited! Bakit nga ba ako nag-come up sa video na to? First, I have to maximize the space in my area, kaya kailangan maliit lang siya. And second, kailangan ko na ng paglalagyan ng mga cosmetics ko. Kasi guys, you have to see this. Dito lang sa mga pouches na to, nakalagay yung mga makeups ko. So, dito yung makeup and dito yung lipsticks. Kaya, I think kailangan na nila ng bahay. So, yun. Kaya, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how I created this mini vanity with recycled materials. Kaya-kaya nyo rin gawin. So, without further ado, let's get started. We will be using recycled materials like these cartons that I already measured. Two for the base and one for the back. We can also use an old picture frame but I don't have one so I bought from the market for around 69 pesos. And tinagal ko na rin yung salamin tsaka yung frame. Then I got these string lights from Shopee. So ang gusto natin is yung parang bulb ang itsura niya. Next, I'm also going to recycle this mirror cover from our previous project. And this is the one that I will be using for our vanity mirror. Then I have these two boxes that we will use as a drawer. This I got from a photocopying center. So, hiningi ko lang yan doon. And I have this marble wallpaper that we will use as cover for this project. Let's now begin by repairing the unpleasant appearance in our box by using a tape. Dahil mukhang maraming pinagdaanan itong mga boxes natin. After that, I wanted to use a gun tucker for security. But you don't have to do it guys. This is totally optional because it already has an adhesive. Next, you wanted to cut based on the design that you like and I'm gonna be using this mirror cover as a pattern. And this is how my design look like. You can now cover the base and the backing of your drawer using wallpaper or any type of contact paper that you like. For this cutout, I only covered the front and I will also create holes for the lights. And this is how it looks like. Next, you wanted to remove the mini bulb in order to insert it at the back of our frame. Ang akala ko nga, hindi siya natatanggal pero buti na lang dahil nakadikit lang siya ng glue stick. Now that the bulbs are removed, you can now place the lights on. Okay, to create holes, gumamit lang ako ng pako guys. And dahil medyo mali pa yung butas na nagawa ko, ginamitan ko na rin ng screwdriver. This is how it looks like without the bulb. And mas maliwanag siya kung wala yun. So kung gusto nyo na mas maliwanag, huwag nyo nalang ilagay yung bulb. Pero kung gusto nyo naman ng sakto lang, pwede ninyong ibalik. Now you wanted to create your drawer and connect them together using a hot glue or any type of strong glue. And I just think that glue gun is perfect for this type of project. Okay, in this case, my drawer is not perfect because of the shape of the carton. But it's fine with me because it's for personal use. Again, use hot glue for additional support. Iba naman kasi talaga guys, pag alam mong may sumusuporta sa'yo, di ba? But anyway, let's go back to our project. So you want to press over 
in order to make sure that they are aligned together. Now for the frame, I used popsicle sticks in order to add support so that it won't fall off, which make it as a backbone, I guess. Yeah. Then I'm using hot glue in order to attach the drawer to our frame earlier. Just make sure na yung pinakapangit na side yung ilalagay natin sa likod. Then you wanted to add another layer of hot glue kasi probably hindi na mainit yung nalagay natin kanina and may possibility na madetach yung project natin. Now, we're into attaching our picture frame. So, itong frame na to ang naging basihan ko kung paano ko sinukat itong buong vanity. Here, I added a little bit of pressure and another layer of hot glue. Now, it's time to add the little borders using the mirror cover that I used from my previous project. So, make sure to check that out because I made a bed canopy using mirrors. And to tell you guys, I didn't realize that the effect of these mirror covers will be a butterfly look. And I just want it to look like a vintage mirror but I don't have a choice because the color of this frame is pink. That's why it looked like a butterfly in the end. <laughs> this is now our drawers and as you can see, kita pa rin yung mga prints niya. And we are going to use these handles that I bought from the market for around 42 pesos. Guys, I'm sorry I forgot to include this in the materials section. Just measure the center. Then I used B7000 and a hot glue to attach it to our drawer. These holes are intended for screws, but I use hot glue, so lalagyan ko na lang siya ng beads mamaya. After that, we can now proceed by covering our drawers with recycled echo bag. I prefer color red, but I don't have one, so I'm going to use felt paper. And I'm sorry ulit guys if I wasn't able to include this in the material section. And also, you can cover the drawers first before putting on the handles. I already made the first one, so here you wanted to spread the glue evenly to the sides of your felt paper. And I guess that the red felt paper brought an elegant look to our vanity. Now, I'm going to cover these holes using these beads. Also, I use this gold bead garland to accessorize our mirror. Then, I also use this flower bead to match the gap. And this is how it looks like when it's finished. Now, it's time for a quick tour dito sa aking mini vanity. Para makita nyo naman ko ano yung mga nilagay ko. Kasi dinecorate ko na rin siya. So, let's start here in my essential oils. Ayan. Essential oil to ng blue water. Merong sakura, ocean, tsaka meron din akong mint and eucalyptus. And then, over here, I have this mini 
keychain ng Eiffel Tower na nakuha ko for 10 pesos. Tapos ipakita ko rin sa inyo tong vintage na notepad. So, nilagay ko siya dyan kasi mahilig ako sa vintage. And then, ito naman, meron akong um, notepad din to. So, ayan siya. Gold kasi. So, perfect sa aesthetics natin. Tapos, letter M. And, I also got this um, mini shot glass. Shot glass siya, pero gusto ko siya dahil gold. And then, this one, hair clip. Now, punta na tayo sa drawer. So, ganito siya, guys. Patayin ko nga sa glit yung ano para makita nyo yung lights. Okay. So, yan. Ganito kasi yung gusto kong kalabasan niya, no? Yung makita ko yung laman ng drawer. So, at least nakikita ko na yung mga makeups, ganyan. So, papakita ko sa inyo kung ano yung mga nilagay ko. Okay, first stop is itong Avon palette. Caroline Play to Slay. Ayan. Wait lang. Bubuksan ko para mapakita ko sa inyo. So, ayan. Hindi ko na rin tinapon yung box. So, kung nandiyan lang siya, nakapatan siya dun. Diba? Ang cute. Parang watercolor lang eh, no? then mga EB Chris Mathematic Lipstick in the shade Lucky. Tapos meron ako nitong brow liner and may mascara na din. Which is maganda siya. And then Caroline Graphic Ink Liner. Mga basic lang yung meron ako na pang makeup. At least mga basic man meron tayo, ba? Tapos itong EB Matte Lip Liner dahil sale sila, especially si Caroline, 49 pesos lang. So, ito 49 din siya. In the shade Toast of New York. So, next stop kong bibilin siguro is yung um, Toast of New York na liquid lipstick. Isa pang cute dito na bagay na gusto, gusto ko din is itong I Can. Yan. Compact. Para siyang compact powder. Pero actually, this is not a compact powder because this is a contact lens storage. O, ba May salamin din siya, o. Oh. So cute. So, nung, nabi, nung ano, binili ko to sa Shopee. And, hindi ko na maalala kung magkano siya. Pero, very cute niya. Let's proceed to my second drawer. So, what I got here. Okay, meron ako dito 2019 na planner. Actually, lagayan lang talaga siya ng mga books and journals. Yan, tapos nilagay ko din itong um, false eyelashes, some notepads. Itong quick journal ng Mercury for 2019. Dito, dito ang sinusulat yung mga video ideas ko. Yan. And some notes na naisip ko. And now, we're on to our final look. And I am so happy at how it turned out. You can see the accent of the butterfly wings. And also, I'm much happier kasi meron na akong paglalagyan ng mga cosmetics. And also, magagamit ko for vanity. And that's it guys. I also encourage you to create one for yourself, your daughter, or your sister. I believe that you can have your own vanity at an affordable price. So please don't forget to click like and subscribe to my channel for more videos. Don't forget to smile and add sparkles to your life. Bye!